Welcome back to another video of Let's Learn Flight Simulator together where you and I will be learning to fly together. I am extremely thrilled to present before you my new playlist on flight simulators on hands down one of the best top notch flight simulator out there Microsoft Flight Simulator. Before I begin let me show you the different versions of Microsoft Flight Simulators that you can buy and differences between them. There are three different versions of Microsoft Flight Simulator that you can buy depending on your budget and your preference. There is no difference between the features and functions itself. The standard edition is the base version that comes with 25 aircrafts. The deluxe edition is the mid-level version where you get 5 additional aircrafts from the standard version. Premium deluxe is the best version you can buy. It gives you 10 additional aircrafts from the standard version. I would like to highlight that the premium deluxe version includes the Boeing 787-10 Dreamliner aircraft. This is what I will be downloading today. As of May 2023 in United States, the standard edition cost $60, the deluxe edition cost $90, and the premium deluxe edition cost $120 plus taxes. Let's see where to buy it from and the installation process. Microsoft Flight Simulator can be purchased from the Microsoft Store. Open up Microsoft Store and search for Microsoft Flight Simulator. Here you can select the version of the Microsoft Flight Simulator you want to buy. After you have purchased it, you will get an option to install. Follow the on-screen instructions for the installation process. First, you will download the basic setup files which will take approximately 4 gigabytes of your data. Then when you click play there will be another mass file download that will take more than 100 gigabytes of your data for me it was approximately 129 gigabytes Alright, after almost 2 hours, here we are. If you have not seen Microsoft Flight Simulator interface before, this is what it looks like. First things first, when you go to the graphics settings, it checks your system capabilities and suggests you the best setting you can run on your computer. Lucky for me, thanks to my computer, I can play Flight Simulator on ultra settings. Let me know in the comment box if you would like to know my computer specs. Then you can select the world data streaming settings. I'm going to opt for satellite data streaming. Select your control device and you should be ready for your first flight. There are literally hundreds of settings that you can select, but at the least, make sure you know how to control your elevators, ailerons, rudders, flaps, and your camera settings. Let's do our first flight and let's fly around the Statue of Liberty. If you enjoyed this video please subscribe to my channel there will be a lot of these videos coming in future thank you very much for watching